hello friends welcome to my channel <coughs> sorry for not demonstrating before project because that time i was literally too busy now i have quite time so i can demonstrate about patrick project how it works is literally too useful for everyone who want to create uh, background transparent with uh, video so how it works so after i done with patrick project i created a separate one like same what it does and here is the example how it works so first i add linear one with the same width triple nine and same height mesh band and the padding zero margin zero orientation is horizontal gravity center particle and horizontal here's the same way here the background color is transparent about the linear one why linear one because it contains the video okay. now here is the linear two which contain the whole button and whole authentication system okay so let me demonstrate it also linear two width mass parent height 750 padding 8 for all around margin 0 horizontal particle it's a vertical one okay. gravity make sure it's left and bottom we can also change it to center horizontal and vertical with effects quite after the gravity the same way weight 0 background color transparent because if you don't use transparent it's gonna get in white okay alpha 1.0 this alpha is really important because i don't think anyone could understand what patrick does with his project but after i discovered he set this linear alpha then i found something nice yeah here in this linear 2 it contained one linear 10 linear 12 and here is the test view 4 but we change it uh, height 60 that's why you can see yep here I use one text view 10 in linear 7 I change text view 10 the white the text color here I used to image view for setting some material after that go to logic set section so here on create I added this block what Patrick did so this block generated this thing let me open my application this one so you can see after this SDK runs what it does if build version SDK initiated it's initiated the KitKat version the windows w.get window is w is like you can choose j or a to j everything later but you must define this character first so here the set flags flag means the flag layout no limit so the linear one mesh parent is no limit it's unlimited position like height is unlimited or infinity so here you can see the layout perms flag layout no limits set that's why it's infinity then i set each and every type faces you can see there are four text views i set it to my custom and i set also the round corner with my round corner block back here on start or active create visible before we go there go to more block here the code here the video view with the media controller here the set style is a more block it's a 3d elevation is the round corner here go there on start 
activity visible here main activity here you can see the linear one which contain this video so, so linear one is equal to add view is the feed view okay you can change like uh, feed view is equal to new feed view you can change it also like uh, feed is equal to new feed view like that that's why at second okay we're gonna um, leave it behind right now so it's the fourth one here whole uh, it's contained with the video view code the same way and here is the string so go to add variable and create a string with the name whatever you want here the person use str cause he said this one so if you change your string name so must you change this name also okay so if you said another name so just change it like here after that it said the gradient or set elevation like that here what about that and on resume it's the same thing uh, about the string uh, when the video start or pause uh, on resume okay the main thing about is the disciple display metric so how it works so first you know so better understand about your resolution current resolution or aspect ratio of your screen or your video so here you can see if i play this video it fits like white but there the top and bottom white uh, so it not really work but it fitted with my screen so it doesn't matter how it works here so this vertical aspect ratio i guess it's like 1082 uh, or 1080 by uh, uh, 2240 something like that so first you must know about the kite laser resolution or you use here so first if you sure about your resolution about your aspect ratio then you can change this to position like metric with pixels multiply by your value and here also the width and height pixels is the width one so here is the height so if your video is vertical position so you can use this to value like multiply by one and here is the multiply by two param is equal to zero so here is the margin is equal to zero so this display metric set for setting it is linear one and linear two in kite position so it's really useful yep so here is a view with display four it's something you want to try like on click one click you can set toast or authenticate or sign in user complete here yeah. and here on file picker component is really important because when you string file that you already created here is value selected the list string file path sorry file path and here's the add source already started with the video view how it works like if you uh, here in sound sound manager you can see already one sound uh, already here in the sound manager added so schedule really has a lot of problem nowadays because you know about the schedule servers are shut down quite a lot yeah so let me pause it for a second here we are so if we go here on start you can see it's selected like android dot resource useless like patrick did with his project video dot background raw sound so it already add one sound dot ogg that sketcher recognize here in the sound manager okay so what you need to do you have to go to file manager and add the correct video file i'm using here jdriver 
so go to sketch here dot sketch here and go to resources sounds here is my project 605 and here I change my video name and rename to sound.ogg as Patrick did with his project that's all guys and you ready to go after that and you can easily run this video manager without any problem so here you go